welcome back to my YouTube channel. So today's video is a morning routine and heaps of people have been asking for a morning routine which I'm super excited about but I just haven't been filming because my heart is in the coffee machine. I haven't been filming that much to be honest because I've been busy doing uni work and everything like that because we start uni tomorrow. Like I'm excited because I was kind of in a good place when we left, like I was enjoying what we were learning. But bruh, bruh, bruh. <laughs> But anyways, so I just made myself an iced latte. Where, where was I going with this? Oh, water. I drink 500 mils of water because it's really good. Get like a glass or two in your body as soon as you wake up just to rehydrate your body from hours you've slept. For me, <laughs> between 5 to 8 for some, maybe like 8 to 10. But I am uh, back on the Vampire Diaries bandwagon. I've watched it three times already. And I've somehow managed to get to season 5, episode 23 already, and it's been literally, I don't even think, two weeks yet. So I don't even think that, that that's probably not good for me, but hey, here we are, and we're feeling good. So, I'm going to down this iced latte, and whilst I do that, every morning I get out my to-do list. I'm sure you would have seen it in my other vlog if you watch my What I Eat In A Day, and then I just take some time just to sit here and write what I need to do today. I'm actually feeling very motivated to film today so I might actually be able to bump off quite a lot of stuff. Oh FYI it was my birthday on Thursday and I'm not one to like celebrate my birthday. I'd rather celebrate other people's because I don't really like everything being on me. I feel like ugh. But anyways it was really cute and my family decorated the living room and I loved it. But those skincare products that I used before the Okana ones uh, they are from my birthday, so I've only had them for about five days, but you know, that vegetable garden's been doing wonder works on my skin. So, I'm just going to do this now. Actually, do you guys want to come along with me? Okay, let's do it. So, what I first sort out is what I'm going to be eating in the day. Okay, breakfast. So, for breakfast, I'm having an iced latte, and I'm going to have some oats. And I'm going to have that really soon. Wait, what's the time? Okay, it's 8.45, we have a meeting at 9.30 and then we do a session after 9.30, so it'll be, we start our session about 10, so I'm just thinking like I want to get an hour before we start training, you know, to get my, let my food sink in, so we're going to make my oats very soon, uh, lunch, I'm probably just going to have what I always have, which is avocado toast, and lemon, and a coffee. I also eat intuitively, like you would have seen my other one, but I just plan this, and if I feel like anything, then I just switch switch it out. A uh, snack. I'm going to do a smoothie. For dinner. Uh, so I'm back at home, and so my parents cook dinner for me, and I only cook when they ask me to, which is, I've only cooked once. On it twice. So... I'm just going to put a question mark. <laughs> and snack to always frozen mango and frozen grapes. And then on the other side, I just write the priorities, like the things I need to do. So I have a meeting at 9.30. And then from that, we're working out at 10. This is the first week of our new program. And basically what we're doing is setting up three days a week where we kind of Zoom, which is like video chat as a team. And we do a session together. So I think the three sessions are a strength session, which is today. Um, we have a conditioning session, like a shuttle session, fitness session together. And then we have a stretch and core, like a yoga and Pilates type workout. And so, oh my god, I need to do a bit of study. Do not want to. I just, like I've already studied and I already know like what I need to do and like all my notes and stuff. But it's just kind of a matter of going over it. And then I need to write a ab workout. Then I need to film. And then... I've got to do another session tonight for training and what I do on a Monday is usually just a run of some sort and then I just add in some netball skills and then probably edit this video. Yeah, I'll show you what we're doing. 
So this is today. So basically I wrote down breakfast through to my last snack, my water, and then I wrote down. Also, if you see my hands being like ripped up, we have a little puppy, I will show you him. And he literally is going through his teething phase and he will bite anything. Like I was walking down the hallway and he jumped up and bit my jersey and ripped a hole in it. Then down here is what I'm doing. So then throughout the day I just tick it off and it just makes me feel really happy that I'm getting things done. I forgot to add also, every single morning, I have to pop into this thing called Smarter Base and basically it's for Netball New Zealand, High Performance Sport New Zealand and whatever franchise you're in, so the Mystics, management and physio, strength and conditioning trainers, they can kind of track how you're going. So every morning I have to wake up and I click this green button here which is like a plus sign and I have to add in a wellness so I click in my wellness and it just has general questions so you have to do it every single morning so for example the first question is fatigue and then it's got like a slider and you slide from 0 to 10 how you're feeling so I'm not feeling fatigued so I'm a 1 uh, sleep quality, how was your sleep last night? I had a very good sleep last night so I'm going to bring that all the way to 10 muscle soreness, do you feel some muscle soreness? Um, I actually do in my neck. So basically what happened was on Wednesday, the day before my birthday, I tried to make this TikTok. I'll put it in here. I gave myself whiplash when I was in my head too hard. I woke up the next morning, it could not be my neck. And I was literally like this. And it was my birthday as well, so I was just like, <laughs> And then the next one is, do you feel stressed? Uh, I'm about to two, because I know that uni's starting tomorrow, and I know that we're going to have exams, but whatever. And how they're doing it, sorry, no exams, they're making them into assessments. Uh, health and wellbeing, and how's your general health? I'm pretty good, I'm about nine. And then you basically submit it, which is the green tab, and then it just uploads so that your coaches and everyone can see it and after every single training session you do as well you have to put it in so you gotta just be like how hard is the training so i do that every morning and it's just a really good way for the coaches and management to check how you are where you're at and then if anything pipes up physios start contacting you just saying hey you put da -da -da on this um are you okay what's wrong so that's really good it's a really smart way because it's <laughs> Smart mess. Okay, let's do breakfast. <laughs> okay, so I always turn on the jug so I can use hot water for in my oats so that it cooks faster because otherwise I feel like it's real clumpy. But, half a cup. Okay guys, so I just came out to my garage and this is where I like do my sessions and I got the biggest fright ever. Why does my... Uh... My dad's going duck shooting and it scared me so much. So I'm just going to be onto this and I'm just going to put you up over there so you can kind of see what I'm doing. But yeah, I'm actually really excited. So I'm just going to go now and get stuck into this meeting and then I'll see you guys when I am done. Oh. Guys, oh my goodness. We just finished our first session of the new program. Our meeting was basically just talking about like the situation that's happening with COVID-19 and when we can start training and when like games will start back for the ANZ Premiership etc etc and then we went through our whole new gym program so we have three new gym sessions a Monday, a Wednesday and a Friday and we went through each one one time and then we ended the chat and had to go do today's session and oh my goodness it was 
so hard but so good and I didn't realize I was going for the song mind you this was when we were doing the run through as well but we were going for an hour and a half which is like a normal gym session but like usually my sessions here only take 60 minutes which I was like okay and then we burnt 580 calories even though it's not that accurate and so now how we're panning out our weeks uh three strength sessions a week three conditioning so sprints long runs a week and then incorporating a ball and ball skills at least five times a week now what i'm going to be doing is filming a little ab routine so i've got like a cute little setup here i'm in my sister's room and i am going to be doing that and then i'm going to post on my instagram and then i'm going to get back to you i'm going to have a shower and then make some food because it is oh my gosh it's only 12 o'clock i usually eat around 1 1 30 but i could do another coffee and i do need to study a bit camera died so this is what I'm having for lunch two pieces of toast with avocado lemon whatever you just saw and my ice latte so I'm just gonna go charge this and I'll see you in about five minutes hello everyone and welcome back so am I on my third coffee answer yes I am and are you surprised <laughs> no you're not because I have just been doing uni study and I bumped it out in 50 minutes while you guys are charging and I have an assignment coming out on the 8th of May I believe which was supposed to be an exam before lockdown but because we went in everything's been changed to online assessments so I was just kind of rejigging my memory making sure that when that comes out I can bust it out <gasps> bust it out oh because I'm trying not to procrastinate like my goals and also can I please have a round of applause I mean you don't have to but I'm gonna give me one I submitted an assessment 11 days before the due date when is that heard of that was that was not me in 2019 I would do it literally two days before it was due and submit it the day it was due, five hours before the deadline closed. So I'm a changed woman, but I've just been doing that study and then now I've just made another coffee because I get to edit and I listen to my favorite music while I'm editing and it's just like a hardcore, hardcore gig. So. I'm just trying to get pumped up, you know. I might make a TikTok before. Can we also please take a second just to appreciate this weather? It is 20 degrees right now and we're in the middle of autumn. The one that I was showing you because I'm better now. I was practicing while you guys were charging. I'm going to make me a snack before I go and train at around 3.34 and... Then I'm probably just going to have a bath because I've been having baths every night and doing like masks and exfoliating and just taking my time and I actually love it. So I'm really like stoked about that. On that note, I just want to say thank you so much for coming along with me this morning and bringing back the love that I have for filming. I actually love it and I love you guys. So thank you so much for watching. Make sure you hit the like if you liked it. You don't have to. Subscribe if you want to. You don't have to either. And you can follow me on my socials, which are down below. You don't have to either. But if you want to, they're down there. And I really appreciate all the love and support that you guys give me. I hope that everyone stays safe. And I will see you very, very, very soon in another video. Bye!